Hey there ESL students and YouTube viewers. Welcome to this video. In today's class we're going to be talking about how to ask for directions or asking for directions. Okay, this is very important for you to learn because if you go to a foreign country, they'll it's for sure that they're going to know how to speak English or somebody's going to know how to speak English. So, let's start, okay? You can be begin with saying excuse me or hey, okay? This is like really proper and polite to say excuse me. You will want to say that, right? But some people just go ahead and say hey, okay? Okay, let's begin. <laughs> excuse me, can you tell me how to get to Northridge Street? Okay, maybe you're not looking for Northridge Street. Maybe you're looking for, I don't know, Seal Avenue. Okay, so you are going to say, instead of Northridge Street, you're going to say, excuse me, can you tell me how to get to Seal Avenue? Okay, or maybe you're looking for Joe's Restaurant, and instead of saying um, any of these two, you're going to say, excuse me, can you tell me how to get to Joe's Restaurant? Or can you tell me how to get to a gas station? Okay, all right. So that's one way to ask for directions. The next one, you can start by saying, hey, is there a, I don't know, a gas station? Let's say you're looking for a gas station. Is there a gas station around here? Okay. Or some people, ins instead of saying around here, they say nearby. Nearby. Okay. This is not supposed to be capitalized, I just do that because it's a habit, but okay, let's just take it away so you don't get confused. Nearby, okay. Instead of saying around here, you can replace it by nearby. Okay, excuse me, is there a gas station around here? Or is there a gas station nearby? Okay, or what's the nearest gas station? Okay, or excuse me, is there a, let's see, and you can say, excuse me, is there an elementary school around here? Or is there a, I don't know, car wash, car wash around here, okay? Or nearby. Whatever you're looking for, you just put it in here, and that's okay. The next one, you can use excuse me or hey, okay? You can say, excuse me, how could I get to Washington Avenue? Or how could I get to, I don't know, Northridge Street, or how can I get to a gas station? How can I get to the Capitolium, okay? However, whatever you want to ask for, you just put it here at the end, question mark, obviously, okay? Excuse me, how can I get to, hmm, let's say, to Northridge Street, Seal Avenue, gas station, school, how can I get to, I don't know, Whatever you're looking for, okay? Doesn't matter. The next one. You can say hey, or excuse me, this time I'm gonna say hey, okay? Hey, do you know where a gas station is? Or do you know where a bank is? Do you know where a, I don't know. Do you know where a church is? Or something, whatever you're looking for, just place it in here. Or you can take away the A. And you could say, excuse me, do you know where Northridge Street is? Okay. Whatever you're looking for, just put it right in here. And that's how you ask for directions. We have four ways of asking for directions. I know that obviously there are a lot of more, a lot more ways to ask for directions, but these are the most common. All right. Okay. I'm going to move into some practice so you can um, get this a little bit clearer. And of course, Exercise your mind and your vocabulary. Thanks for watching. All right, practice time. Okay, as you can see, I have a blank spot here, which you're gonna help me fill out. And these are the places you're gonna be pretending to be looking for, okay? Um, okay, the first one, to Shell Avenue. How would you ask for directions if you wanna get to Shell Avenue? You could use excuse me or hey, either one, right? And you can say, can you tell me how to get to, or could you?
how to get okay this goes here okay okay excuse me could you tell me how to get to Shell Avenue okay that's how you would ask for directions okay the next one you want to know where a gas station is how do you ask for directions if you want to get to a gas station you could say excuse me or hey either one right hey that's right is there is there a gas station around here or nearby right nearby and the next one you want to get to Palm Beach okay how would you ask for dire directions if you want to get to Palm Beach excuse me or hey whichever right how can I get to right how can I get to Oh, the tour is already there. How can I get to Palm Beach? All right, those are three efficient and, um, I mean, effective and common ways to ask for directions, okay? And just replace these here with whichever place you're looking for, okay? Can you tell me how to get to um, Orange Avenue School? Is there uh, an elementary school around here or nearby? Okay. How can I get to Worthington Street? Worthington. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So you just replace these with the place you're looking for. Okay. Write them down. Don't forget them. All right. Next, I'm going to move on to some homework because you need to practice to get perfect. All right. And you also need the feedback from other viewers. Well, thanks for watching. All right, people, here's your homework. You're gonna give me five examples of how to ask for directions, okay? Remember, your homework goes in the comment section below this video. Don't forget to do it. It's important that you practice so you can improve your English, all right? I'll be very happy to see it, and thanks for watching this video. See you in our next video. Hey, before you leave, let me tell you a fun English fact. Did you know that English is the most common language used on the internet? Approximately 80% of the internet is written in English. So now's the time to learn English. So visit our website to watch more free lesson videos or more fun English facts, which is www.eslenglishacademy.com. That's www.esl EnglishAcademy.com. Thanks for watching. Would you like to watch my next video? Click on the television to the right.